Telecommunications Engineer Job Role and Responsibility Most Updated Information By Abhimanyu Network Administrator Job Description Telecommunications engineers use their technical expertise to provide a range of services and engineering solutions revolving around different modes of communication and information transfer, such as wireless telephony services, radio and satellite communications, internet and broadband technologies. Most of the work is carried out on a project basis with tight deadlines and well-defined milestones for the delivery of project objectives. Telecommunications engineers are involved across all aspects of service delivery, from carrying out feasibility exercises and determining connectivity to preparing detailed, technical and operational documentation. Telecommunications engineers are usually employed by telecom service providers, equipment and infrastructure manufacturers, communications software developers, public sector bodies and transport organizations. Working hours. Telecommunications engineers tend to work 9 to 5. However, in order to meet project delivery targets, you may be required to work extra hours from time to time. Travel across the country may also be required, typically on site surveys and periodic inspections. Telecommunications engineer job responsibilities. Know how to handle and support various telecommunication equipments. Identify, evaluate and find solutions to different technical problems. Visit and scrutinize sites frequently to check whether any repair is needed. Work promptly in urgent situations and be prepared to handle any interruptions of service. Give authorization to the equipment quality and give notice to the associated authorities if any alteration is required. Know how to design and build telecommunications system. Be aware of the company and government procedures and standards and then follow or apply them accordingly. Proactive in foreseeing problems in equipment and service and come forward with solutions before they crop up. Troubleshoots equipment and technical defects that could occur in this field. Possess a wide array of knowledge in their field regarding the installation, circuitry, government compliance and telecom systems including waves, fiber optics, data, voice etc. to do their duties. Training and Progression Many employers offer structured graduate training programmers, which last between 12 and 24 months. These schemes combine formal training sessions with opportunities to gain hands-on experience across a range of crucial functions. It's also likely that your employer will support you through the completion of relevant professional qualifications to become a chartered engineer. They may also sponsor you to complete industry standard technology certifications. Career progression is driven by performance, professional experience, and expertise. Once you have become a chartered engineer, you may progress into a managerial role within three to five years. Thanks for watch the video. Kindly share the video in your network or subscribe the channel for more update.